because finally we can have a, uh, uh, a Hispanic uh, puppet because there's a, you know, Carmen is, Carmen Ashbar is Mexican and um, she's playing that character and I, it's, it's funny. She, uh, once I was in Cancun many years ago and I walk into a, a store and somehow this woman who turns out to be Carmen, recognizes me, and, and we talk in Spanish, and she says that her dream in life was always to work with Jim Henson. I mean, people didn't say, I want to be a puppeteer. It was like, I want to work with Jim Henson. And I said, oh, that's nice, thinking, how is this going to happen? You don't speak English. You live in here. I, the, forget it. Next year, she's around the set. Next year, she's still around the set. She finally does it. Like three years later, she's got her own character. So I have to hand it to her. I mean, that was just a great story, I think. Did you have any hand in any of the writing for, for her? Well, after she was a character, I did, certainly. Um, I came up with her name. Uh, How did not Rosita, that she was the, the monster of the caves because she, was, she had like wings, bat wings. So I thought that was interesting. And then she came up with sort of effervescent. She's a complicated character too, I think like Big Bird. You can give her sad things to, to play. And, and uh, she, um, you know, she had a, a heck of a time because she said like, oh my, she, now she says to me, you know, when you guys used to improvise, I used to go nuts. I said, why? She says, because I would practice my English, the exact lines, and then you guys would throw in a joke, and I couldn't respond. Um, but now she can. It's a matter of fact, recently she, uh, she made a, you know, there was a quick change on the set, and she said to me, I couldn't have done that a couple of years ago. But she really heard dream was to work with Jim Henson and, and, uh, and be a puppeteer for him. And let's face it, he really put puppets on the map. Who cared about puppets before Jim? I mean, puppets were something Europeans did, you know? And you studied in, like, theater class when you had to. <laughs> this is something American, you know? They were precious and, you know, he made them accessible.